YouTube, what's up? It's your boy, the American African. And today is like what? I know it's like two weeks and a half into the carnival diet. Um, I kind of got my electrolytes in check, you know. I learned that I had to supplement electrolytes on this diet. Almost like water fasting in a sense. Um, I get a lot of protein on this diet, of course. But I also find that um, I have to watch my fat, like... I have to watch my fat because I have a tendency to eat leaner cuts of meat. Um, just because I eat ground meat a lot. So I have to kind of watch my fat. The past two days, I've tried to eat earlier in the day. So that I can do like, a, you know, 16 hour fast or whatever before I eat again. And uh, it hasn't really been going well. I've been very hungry. Like right now, I'm hungry. I, I finished eating around like noon today it's 10 p.m right now i'm hungry -ish. you know i've been hungry for like probably the past four hours um like when i'm fasting right i have a certain sort of hunger pain this is like worse this is like three times worse than that it's not going anywhere i can drink as much water as i want whatever it's not going anywhere um i'm pretty sure i need fat Today, I probably only had like 100 grams of fat, maybe 120, 130. So, I know the issue is fat. But yesterday, okay, I had a lot of fat. Yesterday, I had over close to 280 grams of fat. I had the same exact issue, you know. And yesterday, I spaced out my meal a little bit more. Not more, really, though. It's like three hours in between. Today, I kind of ate everything in like a two-hour window. Yesterday, I, I guess I ate everything in like a four-hour window. You feel me? Um, this kind of started after I stopped eating eggs. This also kind of started after I stopped taking sweeteners, you know. You know, my Zevia drink. I decided that I must go strict carnivore. I don't know how I'll be deciding this shit. But sometimes I just wake up in the morning and I feel a certain way. And I decided, you know, I want to go strict carnivore. Well, I guess it's still not strict because I use seasoning other than salt. And um, I'm not only eating beef. But it's pretty close to strict carnivore. You know, it's pretty much just meat and water that I'm taking. And, of course, electrolytes. I still like this diet. I still think it's dope as shit. You know, I'm able to go to the gym, go all out. I'm able to... Um, I, I haven't been able to run yet because this injury I have, but it's not a real injury, but yeah. I have a shin splint. I don't know how I really feel, you know? It's weird now water fasting. I haven't water fasted this week. I almost did a three-day water fast earlier this week, but I decided, I, I, you know, to surrender to the diet, you know, for now. I let it have its way. I feel like the month of April, I kept trying to do extended water fast and it didn't really go my way. Now the month of May, I'm doing a carnivore diet. And I feel like what's really happening is I'm just maintaining my weight, but I'm putting in a lot of work. But I'm not mad. I'm not angry because it's, it's me, you know, it's me. Like, if I simply control what I intake at a better in a better way, I will win. If I really pay attention and watch. Right now, I'm just kind of recording and documenting everything. I'm not actually saying, okay, let me make modif modifications and changes yet. I haven't really made any modifications or changes. What I've pretty much been doing is going to the grocery store every day, buying some meat, go exercise, come back home, cook the meat, eat it. It's really like OMAD, but... What I do is, let's say I buy three pounds of meat, right? And it's three different packages. I'll take one, I'll cook it, I'll eat it. If I'm still hungry, I'll go ahead and make the other one. And then if I'm still hungry, I'll go ahead and make the other one, right? And if I'm eating eggs that day, I probably would have ate the eggs first or last or with the meat. It just depends on how I feel. That's pretty much what I've been doing. In my opinion, it's successful. It's just that I haven't been able to exercise because of my injury, you see? I'm at a point where it's like, you know, it's warmer outside. Exercise is part of my 
my daily regimen, you know what I'm saying? Whether it's the gym, whether it's a walk, whether it's both, it's part of my daily regimen. I haven't really been able to do it. I've only done it the past two days. Ironically, these past two days, I've also been very hungry. I'm still trying to surrender to the diet. I haven't totally surrendered, right? I'm used to saying I'm in a fasted state. My body's adjusted to this state, so therefore I don't get hungry. But in this diet, I, in my opinion, I don't really know yet, but it's like my body isn't immediately going into fat storage. It's still expecting me to feed it. You know what I'm saying? It's like I'm in ketosis. I know I'm in ketosis because I had the keto flu last week. Um, but... It doesn't feel like I'm in ketosis. Like, I don't have keto breath. I don't have any weird keto side effects that I'm used to. I don't smell it in my pee. You know what I'm saying? This this whole diet is just new to me. And I didn't think it would be so different than ke be, you know the keto diet. I didn't really think so. I've been kind of thinking about the keto diet again. Like, I don't know. Not, not that I'm going to quit this diet or anything, but I just feel like with the keto diet, I've done it so much that I just know it so well that I know what's going on. I know what to modify and I know exactly how to modify it, you know? But with this diet, it's like I'm at zero carbs for goodness sake. Zero carbs. And in my opinion, I'm not getting results. You know what I'm saying? Like my weight isn't dropping. It's just it's going up and down, up and down, up and down sideways trend doesn't really matter how much fat I eat which is weird it doesn't matter it might matter how much protein I eat maybe I'm eating too much protein I mean I, I just don't know I don't want to know I put on taking my time learning it reading it, taking my time learning it reading it I understand that everyone watches YouTube videos everyone reads forums Everyone likes to say, try this, try this, try that. I, I totally get it, but if you know me by now, you, you know the way I am. I like to learn on my own. But I'm not saying don't drop your suggestions or, you know, just do it in a respectful way. I, I read them. I'm not saying I'll do them, but I'm listening. I still have a feeling that electrolytes has something to do with what I'm experiencing as far as hunger goes. Um, I truly believe my body has adjusted to carnivore. Like, I've been doing carnivore since May 3rd, okay? Since May 3rd, I've been doing carnivore. Today's May 20th. 17, 18 days in the carnivore diet. There's only one day. That was before I did the three-day water fast last week. So, I think it was last week, Monday. Maybe it was, was it last week? Whatever. There's only one day where I took in carbs. And it was in the form of psyllium husk. It was fiber. Because I wanted to try and clear up my bowels before I started the three-day water fast I did. But other than that, I haven't had any carbs. I've been strict. Um, not strict, but I've been doing carnivore diet. It wasn't the plan. It, I just liked it. You know, I just go with the flow. Be like water, go with the flow. You know the model for 2021. But, you know, my energy is up. I'm happy. I'm ready to go. A beautiful thing about this diet, I get sleepy at night. In fact, I sleep a lot. I've been sleeping a lot lately. Like, after I eat, I usually get sleepy. That's so new to me. In fact, I was eating at night before, right? Like, I was eating between 10 p.m. and 12 a.m. As soon as I finish eating, I hit the bed. I sleep like a baby. I haven't experienced that in such a long time. I was really enjoying it that I kept eating late. But I decided, okay, let me flip it. Let me try eating early and see if anything changes. But, of course, I'm doing exercise now. So, that's just another variable into the equation. I won't know what really fixed it. If this is fixed now, I won't really know. Last note. I've been pooping. So, digestion is good. <laughs> All right. It's your boy, the American African. You know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.